tries to get past Seleski a night off for the Tampa Bay Lightning can rest their number one netminder and try to steal a game on the road. Those nights don't come too often, Jonesy. It's only his fifth game of the year. Underway. Lightning are dealing with Flyers win that puck battle. And this line will flip the puck to center. It's played there by Giroux. Giroux trying to get free. Turns with it. Drops it back. Shot over off and it's saved by Elliott. Comes back out to Katuri. He's got room. Moves in. Deals it off. Over off. Back for Couturier. Save Elliott. Might have gone off Couturier's skate, but Elliott still had to make the save. And knowing where he was going to go with the puck ahead of time. He got it to Gabriel Fortier. who will clear it out to center right. Now moving on in. 48 first to speed. Gets the backhander off save. And the rebound. Is it in? Hart just throwing the pads across, hoping to keep it out. And they say no goal. Original stop right here is... 48 tries to go five hole and there's Whoa. Killorn to get that puck. Somehow it stays underneath Carter Hart. It looked like the back pad ends up making the save here right there. And he kicks it back underneath him. There is no video evidence that that puck crossed the line, but you know they're going to try to take a good look at this one and see if they can find some. Uh, I'm going to say this one's going to stay out of the net. Watch it underneath the first pad. The second one gets it and kicks it back underneath, and that does not look like it went over the line. Couldn't get that puck, though, past Joseph, who steals and then sends it to the middle of the ice. Here's Ryan McDonough moving up. McDonough to stand, coach for the shot, save, hard rebound, they score! McDonough rams home the rebound, and it's 1-0 Tampa Bay. Adding the rebound into the net. And watch the play by McDonough. Bottom of your screen right there. He taps it in. A good hand-eye coordination. Stamco shot right there. It's a wobbling puck that catches the top of the blocker of Hart. Kind of wobbles towards McDonough. Omar back to the puck and got it to the point. Here's McDonough. McDonough to Belmar. Turns with it back to McDonough. His shot goes wide and then they score. The Caramus Perry tucked it in. And the Lightning have a 2-0 lead. Just like that. Bang, bang. Consecutively here early. And right there, McDonough's shot misses the net. Perry pounces on it, banks it off the skate of Carter Hart. Good hard shot by McDonough. Not sure if Maroon tipped it on the way to the net, but Corey Perry knows his way around the net. I only hope that some repairs are going on and he would come back, but at this point they are without. Best all-around player, and the Flyers have to figure out a way. Better back to Provorov, and now the stretch pass ahead for Atkinson. Left wing feed that eluded Giroux and winds up in the stick of Colton. That's his cross ice. Hedman gets to it. The right wing feed. The shot, and they score! Radish blasting it by Hart. It's 3-0. Tampa Bay. Radish got his first in the NHL last night, has his second one. 24 hours later. What a bank pass get away from Provorov, and then Tampa pounces on it again. It's Hedman leading it up the ice and makes a nice cross ice pass to Radish, who walks in and slaps it right off the inside of the crossbar, just over the blocker's shoulder of Carter Hart. It's a well placed shot. Hedman in, that one deflects right to Radish. Radish back out. Here's Hedman. Hedman in the shot. Save hard rebound. They score. And it's Kachuk who will get his first NHL goal. Kachuk jumping on that rebound. Hart lost sight of it. And Kachuk, strange reaction for his first NHL goal. Kind of like, yeah. Head up all the way. Perfectly placed pass. And then he joins the rush. Wants it. Gets it. Gets it to the net with traffic. And Kachuk walks in and taps that one in. I guess he was envisioning an end-to-end -end rush, not a tap-in where the goaltender couldn't find it, as you can see. To Frost. And Frost will get it to Atkinson, and he just played it to the middle. It's knocked down by the Lightning, and they clear it. They got it past Atkinson. Joseph first toward the puck. So out comes Hartman. He plays it right to Joseph, who's shot! Winds up in the net. They score! Matthew Joseph will get the shorthanded goal. It's 5 nothing. Carter Hart as he was scrambling to get back in the net. And Joseph has the fifth goal for the Lightning here. There it is off the body. Just quickly spins and taps it back towards the net. And 
Joseph, good effort up the ice here. Backs away, takes that puck, and then just chips it. He's out there now after that power play opportunity. And he's got the energy. He's in front of the net now. There's a shot. Tipped in. It did not go. They say they may have to check that one. It was flagged down by the Lightning as it was in the air right along the line. Yeah, he's having yeah, a heck of a year. He's, he's, he's having a terrific year. And, you know, the one thing that'll be on his mind in this third period, keeping the shutout for Brian Elliott. Yeah. I mean, that's, he's outstanding captain for the Tampa Bay Lightning. And they finally got it. Wouldn't you know, I'm surprised they didn't get it in the same game, but they get it back-to-back -back nights, those two, because they seem to do everything together in their hockey careers. There's Colton getting that one right across the blue paint. Jones makes the save. That was Radish again. The play, do things that separate yourself from everybody else that's battling for the job that you want. And these guys have found a way. Take it to the wall by Braun. Lawton in heavy traffic. Shuffles it off to the right wing. Boys get two in. And Hedman coming on a great pass by Hedman to Perry. Makes the move. Centers it. And they score. Maroon off the feed. It all starts again with Hedman. And it's six nothing Tampa Bay. Fed pass from Perry eventually. There's the Flyers from the effort to puck out of the zone. McEwen there, Hedman with a blind backhand pass right on the tape, and then Perry and Maroon go to work. Watch Maroon open up for the pass across. The handle can't get his stick. Perry finds it. Assist in his first four games with the Flyers this year. Offside Giroux. Now low deflection score Atkinson with a subtle redirect. No celebration, but it is a power play goal for the Flyers. First time in a while, and the shutout is gone for Moose. Area of Atkinson. Let's see if Atkinson gets a piece of it or not. There's off the skate, skate. of Atkinson and in. Almost like it went through the blade. It's more subtle than I thought. Yeah. So a power play break. Right there off the foot, tougher to tell at that angle, but it's it across the line and then rolls it around out of the reach of Lundeman. Lundeman gets it now though, and Brown for the angle of shot, and that one clanked off iron as it might have gotten Elliott in. As you mentioned, JJ, here's the high rising shot, and there it is. Oh, it wasn't crossbar though, post. Yeah, just here's underneath. Side. Here's Maroon across. Sergeyev, Colton, back out it goes McDonough. Now Sergeyev side in the net. They try to center it. It comes all the way through to Colton. Quickly back out. They cut a shot score. Not sure if that went off of Perry. But it looks as though it did. Corey Perry and so has his third goal against the Flyers this year. And it's 7-1 Tim. Earlier before the game tonight, you want to check it into the net. And that's what Perry does. Makes a couple of plays down low. He's... In front there, the shot of the high riser from McDonough goes off the body of Perry. Not sure which body part, but may have been the uh, stick first, then the glove, then the... Braun, Yandel, across, Brown, the shot, missing the net. Bounces out this way, and the shot by Bunneman denied by Elliott. Martin Jones looking out, he replaced Carter Hart in the second period. Here is... Sanheim blasting one blocked by Kachuk second try into traffic goes off glass Lindblom gets the rebound his angle shot hit the post Elliott reaching for that puck one last crack at it from McEwen and that will do it for this game the fans that remain not happy the Flyers aren't happy either as they lose to the Lightning 7-1 Elliott gets the victory his third with the Lightning